Hello everyone and welcome to the Trade Ideas Live Trading Room Recap for Friday, October the 14th. My name is Barry Anderson. I'm the moderator of our trading room. This is the address to get into the room and it is a free room in that I share my screen all day long and I'm on the mic between 9 a.m. and usually go to 4 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. This is a, uh, just type this into your browser, click on it and you'll be taken to a subscription page. You'll see a promo code there if you want to take out a subscription to Trade Ideas. Works out to a little over $4 a day. Or on an annual basis for our premium service. Hmm, well, this was a very, very boring day, guys. Um, and uh, I, you know, it's going to be a very quick video. In fact, uh, I, I was in a, uh, I don't know, four or five, six trades, just got chopped up a little bit, you know, three, four, five, six cent losses. Uh, so, really, nothing uh, to write about or to talk about. I am in this one, uh, I'm in at 13. Uh, 1732 uh, this was a holly trade uh, the alert was at what was the alert at the alert was at uh, 1701 oops sure i've got my symbol linking there we go so the alert was at 1701 right here now i didn't take the trade uh here uh, you know and it really in fact, that's not true. I ended up taking the trade at 1708. I forgot. Now it's starting to move a little bit here. Okay. I actually took the trade at 1708 and I got stopped out as it went down through 17, took myself out right at 17 or 1703, really. Um, you know, the rest of the market was just kind of meandering around. However, I did say that if it broke this level right there, see that level? It looks like it's about 1730 that I might be interested. So I did take the trade. So, you know, it has a high of 1751. Maybe, just maybe it can continue on uh, up there. So I'll keep an eye on this one. I, and actually it's starting to, uh, starting to move nicely here. Just a second, 1744. Let's see if it can, uh, I'm going to put an alert right here. So I, I, at least I hear it. And they're right at the high of the day. So, you know, at least it's um, at least that one is moving just a little bit, and so we'll see what happens. Really, the only one I want to talk about the uh, I, I did do a trade in TRXC early, very early. This was the one that I was uh, that I was swinging um, this is when I swung from what do we know Friday? I guess that was Wednesday. Swung it, uh, got in at 209, did not take the pop up here at 233, uh, held it and then ended up uh, selling it as it broke down below two saw it uh, strong again uh, there was i think there was some newsletter writer uh, that said you know trashed it or something so um but anyway i got back into it here i saw okay it's, it looks pretty strong again um took the trade at 208 and exited at 216 as it was coming down again and you know i may watch it going forward see see what happens but um you know there's a quick kind of a quick scalp the only other one i'm in excuse me, is uh, GST. I'm still in this one. This is a swing. I got in yesterday at uh, 115. Uh, it popped this morning. Actually, I got in right here and it popped 123. I did not take anything out and moved back down, held it. A little bit of action here. I, my, my out was kind of going to be 110 if it broke down below it. It didn't. And then it popped up to 120. So still going to hold this one and see what happens. All right, well, again, just a quick video, really nothing to talk about today. There's only about uh, six Holly trades, nothing, nothing really, no continuation, a little bit surprising. You know, earnings week started this week with Alcoa on Monday. Um, usually we get, but I think next week we'll start to see more and more earnings plays and we'll see a lot more continuation, a lot more activity. And of course, next week, next week does start our open house as we call it. So from Monday to Friday, you will have access to uh, trade ideas, premium, our full package live. Uh, of course, you can come into the trading room. You'll see how we use it. I will have Holly on display in the trading room and just check the, the, the text in this, uh, in the email, the YouTube email that gets sent to you. I uh, just check, uh, check the text and you'll see the link to sign up for the open house that starts on Monday. And again, Monday to Friday inclusive. Now, if you can't make it Monday, and you could make it Tuesday as an example, um, we're actually doing it this way. Most people, of course, will be up, uh, will we'll take it from Monday to Friday, and inclusive. And, but we'll, we're also allowing you all the way up to Wednesday. So if you actually can only start on Wednesday, you will still get five trading days. So you'll go to the following Tuesday, all right? So, uh, but after Wednesday, uh, you cannot sign up for a five-day pop. 
And that is about it. Oh, I'll get back to the uh, trading room and see what's happening. I see that the uh, DK actually came back down, but uh, you know, I'm going to hold on to it a little bit. Maybe, maybe, it, maybe it'll challenge me if the market market uh, gets a little bit of a bid here. Maybe it'll, um, you know, it'll start to rise a bit. All right. Well, thanks for listening, and I hope to see you in the trading room on Monday. Bye bye.